So hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're talking hashtag singles day because apparently it is singles day and who knew that was even a day, but apparently today is singles day. So I figure we can head over to Twitter and see what the tweets say and let's talk about it. So hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And like I said, in this video, I wanna talk about singles day because apparently it's singles day. So we're gonna head over to Twitter and search hashtag singles day and see what the tweets say and kind of discuss and yeah discuss and have opinions about it because i mean let's have an opinion about the fact that there's a singles day anyway like why uh but anyways i guess everyone needs a day i mean do they have a marriage day do they have like people that are married like a married day is that the anniversary who knows Anyways, let's see what the tweets say. So Maria at the desert always, or is it dessert? I think it's desert. The desert always says being single is not a criteria to think of a person that he is, he or she is alone. You can feel the you can you can feel the loneliest woman on earth being in a bad relationship or a toxic marriage hashtag singles day that is true um i know plenty of people that have been in relationships especially marriages over like a long period of time that have felt very lonely and i think even in some of the the videos that I have done prior to, like I think it was hashtag relationships, if you're interested in that, I'll link that video below. But you know, you can be in a marriage or a relationship and actually like be roommates. I think it was a hashtag relationship or you were, are you in a relationship or a habit, which can tend to feel like if you're in a habit, you can be lonely in a relationship because you know, sometimes you know life takes over things happen and people get on autopilot and you know you got kids the kids have things and then you have your own things and you want to have time for your things that give you happiness and then i mean there's only 24 hours in a day so it can be very hard to maintain that great relationship and it oftentimes leave people in relationships feeling alone and uh, a good, I would say a good um, piece of advice that I've always heard is that always make time for a date night. If you're in a marriage or a relationship, always just like set it like an appointment, like a doctor's appointment, a dentist appointment, your date night is an appointment for each other. And that is so important to maintain that relationship. And people will try to take your time. That's what people do. People try to take your time, whether it's to school or family or friend, whatever the case is. People will try to take your time, but you, I think that it is important to make time for your relationship and the other person. And so, yeah, you really have to set that time aside for both, for the other person and actually make that commitment and hold it in place like it's an appointment. Like, it that is that important so definitely agree with that you can actually feel very lonely even when you're in a relationship <laughs> so sin at oh my gosh i can't even pronounce that her twitter name but it's s-i-n-e says wow we get to be celebrated hashtag singles day <laughs> i think that's funny so that that got two retweets and 48 hearts so this is a good one destiny at at the fat author uh says first year in a long time that i've been a hundred percent in love with the most important relationship in my life my relationship with myself and my body hashtag singles day that was a great tweet i love that because honestly when it comes to um, relationships i think that in order to have a healthy relationship you have to have a healthy relationship with yourself first always 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 have a healthy relationship with yourself 
first before trying to have a healthy relationship with someone else. <laughs> so beyond expectations, LTD, oh, what does LTD mean? I don't know. Says hashtag singles day, one of the biggest events for online retailers. That's an interesting fact. So apparently a lot of, a lot of these tweets are about um, loving yourself. Okay, so Millionaire Mindset um, says take advantage of being single uh, by using this time to focus more on you and your growth in life. Hashtag singles day and the, the fist pump thing. So that actually got 229 hearts and 76 retweets and like I said, I really think, I really think that being single can be a great thing. Uh, I think too, being able to enjoy the journey, where, whatever stage in life you're, you're in is important. So whether you're single or you're in a relationship, enjoying that stage and not looking at it as like a bad thing. Just uh, enjoying the time and, and learning about yourself. Um, honestly though, I feel like you learn more about yourself in a relationship because that other person's going to tell you about yourself, usually. Um, but there are ways in which you can work on yourself, obviously, and grow as a single person as well. Um, you do have a lot more time to be able to do those things and actually uh, do a lot of introspection. So, great, great tweet. Okay, so I'm not going to even try to pronounce his name, but I think this is interesting because this tweet is about flirting and it says if you're single you are free to flirt happy sing hashtag singles day now i'm always curious about flirting because i feel like sometimes that can be misconstrued for being charismatic or kind to someone else um i i'm just always so curious about it so i'm always I would like to know from you, is flirting okay if you're in a relationship? Now, my idea of flirting is not with an intention. So flirting, well maybe that's what flirting is. Flirting perhaps is being kind and charismatic to someone of the opposite sex with the intention with getting with them or wanting to be with them of some sort and flirting or not flirting is just being kind and charismatic to someone of the opposite sex but without the intention of getting with them or being with them i don't know like what what is flirting i guess i could look it up but uh i mean it's really up to um people's perspective obviously so i'm curious is flirting okay to do without the intention of being with the other person is it okay to do if you were in a relationship now i'm saying that you're being charismatic and kind to someone else maybe like in a flirtatious way as they say but you don't have any intentions with getting with that person now with that being said your intention can be not to be with that person or not to try to be with that person but it's all about perception as well so if the other person perceives that you are being flirtatious flirtatious and that you do want to be with them so does does that make it wrong so i don't know it's just an interesting interesting concept i think is the whole flirting thing so Hey, whatever you think about it, I would love to know. Leave your comments below about what is flirting, if, if it's okay to do when you're already in a relationship. Sorry, somebody. I was running outside the window. I was like, squirrel, squirrel. Anyways. So I think I'm going to leave it there because I think that was a great one to leave it with. Um, Singles Day uh, is an interesting thing. I think they just make up days for... I don't know but apparently according to these tweets singles day is like black friday over in china so like like the retailers go crazy over this day for some reason so 
I don't know. I mean, obviously, it's a day. People are having fun with it. That's all that really matters. Anyways, that's all I have for this video. I hope you found value in it. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. Sorry. I invite you to subscribe to my channel. I like to do videos like this, talking about different topics, thought-provoking topics, um, life, relationships, all sorts of things. Also, shameless plug, I am wearing our cosmetic line, Magical Beauty. If you're interested in that, I will leave the link below for that as well. And until the next video, I will, well, and until next time, I will check you in the next video. Peace.